Hey everybody, this is Paul with RC Foam Fighters. Welcome back for this week's video. Um, this week I'm going to be getting into a new project that I've been working on. I've actually um, gotten into rebuilding the uh, Foam Fighter 22. I originally built it out of foam board, but um, due to a uh, control rod failure, I ended up crashing into the ground and kind of totaling it. But I was really happy with the way it flew up until that point, so I decided I wanted to rebuild the plane. So this time I decided to basically scale it up about 10%, going from a 24 inch wingspan to a 28 inch wingspan. And the major thing I'm gonna be doing with the plane is I'm gonna be building it out of EPP with the um, Henry style fiberglass weave to make it stronger. Um, I'm also gonna be adding some other, other features on there, um, rudders, and I'm also gonna be including a Bombay door on the plane. So I already have all that installed. Um, I'm gonna show you how I kind of built it through uh, basic pictures and then we'll get on to the main of flight here in a little bit. Okay guys, I got the plane pretty much about 98% finished. Um, the only thing I need to do is finish up some of the taping, like the uh, um, tape, black tape for the cockpit glass and uh, some of the other decals I was going to put on. But other otherwise, the uh, plane is pretty much finished up, getting ready to go do the maiden flight. Um, I just wanted to go over some of the features with you that I did add to this plane. Um, I did add rudders um, that work on this plane, as you can see here okay and it does have the separate elevator and ailerons there's the elevator and here's the ailerons okay one other cool feature I did put on this plane is on both sides I've got little Bombay doors that I uh, rigged up to the gear landing gear channel so you just flip the switch and they open up and I'm gonna be putting little uh, streamer bombs or maybe some airsoft BBs in there to drop out when I'm flying. So you just flip the switch and it opens and closes. So anyway, those are uh, some of the basic features. So let's get out to the park and see how this baby flies. Hey everybody, it's Paul. Uh, we're out at the park and getting ready to do a main flight with this new uh, Fat Boy F20, FF22. Um, this thing weighs in at about 38 ounces with the motor and is putting out a little over 40 ounces of thrust. So I think it should be all right. It's about 98% finished. I still got to put on the uh, taping for the cockpit and stuff, but I'm just going to go ahead and go and uh, do the main flight. So let's see how, see how it goes. Here it goes. This is going to be the first toss in the air. I wish me luck. Hey Tom, get the radar gun. Thank you. 
Like I said, it might be deceiving because of the size. How's the CG and all that? Looks like it flies pretty locked in, man. Yeah. How the rolls and loops and things. Slower landing yeah. than your other plane for yeah. as heavy as it is, man. Okay, hey guys, how's the maiden flight? Um, looks like it flies pretty good. It's definitely not a speed plane. It's actually pretty floaty for how heavy it is. I was pretty amazed. But uh, I'm happy with the um, main flight. Looks like it flies pretty good. Okay, guys, hey, we're back at the house now. Um, seems like the uh, main flights went fairly well. Um, there was a few things that I did notice that I didn't like about the plane. Um, the rudder control, I think I might have made a mistake by creating the rudders that are kind of angular. Um, I think it's kind of creating it so it does a weird roll when I um, use the rudder function. So I may just take off the rudders. It seemed like it flew fine without the rudders. And it did seem like it was kind of lacking power. I think there's a lot of drag on there. Um, part of it is the, um, the air ducts have the Bombay doors or Bombays kind of in there. So it kind of blocks some of the flow of the air. So that's probably creating drag. And also it just seemed like this motor just didn't have enough power to push the uh, 7x4 prop. So I might be going up with a bigger motor and um, seeing how I can reduce the weight by maybe taking off the rudder controls and I may even take out the Bombay doors on this, we'll see. Um, but that'll probably be covered in the upcoming videos. So thanks again for joining us. Um, this is the, not the last video on this plane. I'll probably be doing some more follow-up videos here after I do some modifications. But thanks again for joining us for uh, this week's video. Okay guys, just before you go, I just wanted to announce our July 2009 uh, drawing giveaway. Um, for this drawing, we're going to be giving away a um, motor and speed controller from our affiliate RC Hot Deals. This is the 2200 KV motor, the 2212.6 motor. The motor comes with the motor mount, the prop adapter, and all the bullet connectors you need. And it also comes with the 30 amp speed controller. So if you'd like to enter in this drawing, just make sure you're a subscriber to our RC Foam Fighters channel here and send an email to admin at rcfoamfighters.com with the subject line July Drawing 2009. Okay, and that's all you got to do is send that. Oh, and the content of the email also include your YouTube username so we know that you're a subscriber for RC Foam Fighters. Okay. So uh, good luck to everybody entering the drawing. Um, some lucky winner is going to get it. So hope you guys all uh, take a turn and enter it. Good luck. Okay, that was the, the second flight. Um, <laughs> try to take out the camera, woman. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>